Every case of COVID-19 is different. Symptoms and the rate of recovery vary by person. Mary Freebed Rehabilitation Hospital has put together a series of short videos online. So joining us to tell us more, we have physician Kelly Armstrong. Thanks so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. Yeah, of course. So first of all, let's just start off talking about Mary Free Bits and what those are. Yeah, so Mary Free Bits are short videos for education that we've produced for our community um, and really giving tips and tricks for monitoring your symptoms if you've had COVID-19 and really thinking about things that you might need to pay attention to if they're not um, improving like you think they might, uh, like they should be as far as recovering from an illness. Kelly, talk about what it was like putting these together because it does seem like so many people over the past, you know, over this pandemic, symptoms have varied from, you know, you know, all kinds of different things. Yeah, we've had to be really thoughtful about um, what types of disciplines as far as what kinds of providers are involved in this. Because COVID-19 produces symptoms that are so variable, we have all sorts of different types of um, medical providers that are involved with this. So I put together one based on sort of the, the overall medical piece of it. There's physical therapists involved, occupational therapists, even nutritionists to think about um, things that you might not think about when recovering from an illness like this. Absolutely. And maybe talk about the importance of just really taking your time and you're in the recovery and making sure your body has time to heal. Yeah, so that's the, the principle or the theory about pacing. So pacing is a, a really simple sort of rule of thumb to say your body has been through a pretty significant event. COVID-19 affects people and really really significant ways, even if symptoms haven't been that serious. And so that just means it's a slow and steady approach to recovery, whether that be improving breathing, improving fatigue. We really just take our time and sort of go two steps at a time and hope that that one step back doesn't happen. If it gets to the point where maybe someone's recovery is not going the way they want it, is there help still there? Absolutely. So we have an entire COVID-19 rehab program that we've established at Mary Freebed to address all of the different components that patients may experience when they um, go through an illness like that. Um, and so we have a team-based approach where a physical therapist, occupational therapist, psychologists sometimes, if people have anxiety and depression related to COVID, um, nutritionists are involved. And so we evaluate a patient and sort of look at what each person's individual needs are based on how COVID has affected them and put together a treatment plan that sort of helps bump them up in the areas of life that they're struggling with um, to get back to a more normal life. Yeah, absolutely. And most importantly, how can people find these bits and access this information? Yeah, so maryfreebed.com slash bits is our website where these little snippets of information are. Um, you can always go on the website and look at our general information number. You're welcome to call um, just our main Mary Freebed number, um, which is listed on the website to get in contact with us. Um, we can always sort of take each individual's um, information and try to talk you through if you need to see a physician or need to start with your primary care physician and things like that. Um, but if you're questioning any part of your recovery and you feel like things just aren't quite right, it is okay to reach out. 